Uh, and I've seen quite a change, uh, both in the finance market and also the political scene. And of course, some of them uh, may not be uh, to my liking, but it has been a enormously <laughs> a fluctuating fortune uh, in these 25 years. Hong Kong has been among the top in terms of fundraising uh, uh, in the world for, for equity markets. And uh, Hong Kong has already, uh, for a long time, managed to maintain its relevance among the top financial centers in the world. But of course, uh, uh, with the, with the uh, de uh, development of the COVID pandemic, uh, things has not been so good in the past few years. People want a good, decent job and uh, some place they can live. But I think there are some, some things that really went wrong in Hong Kong. The number one is really housing prices shot through the roof. This is outrageous. Hong Kong has the most outrageous price, uh, poverty prices in the world. A young person has to work 30 years in order to buy a flat, I think that created a lot of social uh, friction.